Welcome back, it's in Clever and Smart. I've been moving twice since the pincetter got fully functional, but before I show you more of that, let me present my brand new LEGO room. And here it is! It's been over a year since I posted anything about the pincetter. It currently works quite well, but I'll show you more about that in a bit. I'll just play a frame here so you can see how smooth the operation is. The motor that controls the pin grippers inside the setting table can sense if there's a pin standing or not. If you got a strike, the grippers can move freely, but if they're standing pins, those pins will be in the way of the grippers, stalling the motor early and telling the program to respot the pins. I'm pretty happy with that, but what exactly is it that has changed? Let's go over some key differences since the last time and how it works. This is my trusty train regulator, used for the motors that are constantly powered during operation like the motor for the ball return, and this motor that powers the transport band. The rest of the pincetter is controlled by three powered up hubs. That's right, no more Mindstorms robots. These are programmed using PyBricks, which lets me run programs on the hubs themselves, just like the Mindstorms robots, but at a fraction of the price. All three hubs communicate using Bluetooth, without the need of a smart device, Really neat! Since last time, I've got many comments pointing out the new setup of the setting table, so let me quickly show you what that's about. This linkage raises and lowers the setting table, similarly to how the lowering link works on a Brunswick A2. It reverses direction during the pin detection cycle, and goes a full rotation during the reset cycle. And best of all, it also allows for off-spot pins, since the table can't jam. And it's smooth! Now what's this? A box sent all the way from the US to Sweden? Wonder what's inside? Thanks to Mango for sending me a whole box of different pins. My bedroom suddenly looks much better with these on display. And thank you all for watching. <laughs>